Hi everyone, welcome to the MSCR Holiday Ornament Kit. I'm Miss Julia, and in today's video, we'll be going through all of the supplies that you should have in your holiday ornament kit. Miss Carrie, my sister, and I will be moderating our classroom, so if you're missing anything or have any questions, you can feel free to post in the classroom and we'll respond. So let's get into our kits. Here's mine. The first thing I'm pulling out is a set of paper. This has our welcome letter. It has the list of supplies, so if you're missing anything, you'll know, and a set of instructions for each of the ornaments that we'll be making. If you want this to be a screen-free experience, go ahead and use those instructions instead of the videos for making your ornaments. Otherwise, you could watch the videos and use the instructions to help make your ornaments. The next thing I have is some tissue paper. I have some gold, some white, some light blue, and some dark blue. Then I have an assortment of pipe cleaners. I have three green, two red, one white, one silver, and one brown. The next thing I have are several little bags. I grouped the supplies together by ornament and put them into small bags so that it was easier to find what you're looking for in your supply kit. This first bag that I'm pulling out has one thing of colored pencils, a small piece of brown paper, some fabric, two different sizes of cupcake liners, three of each, three big white ones, three little colored ones. These ones you might have slightly different than what's in my kit. Then also I've got two star stickers and one star glitter in there, a smaller bit of silver pipe cleaner, a small brown stick, and two pieces of coated wire. The next bag that I have has a whole bunch of little styrofoam balls, some black felt, some googly eyes, and some orange felt. Then I have a bag with a whole bunch of beads, two different sizes of styrofoam balls, some red felt, a bit of red, a bit of black, and a bit of orange pipe cleaner, and five toothpicks. The last bag that I have has some shiny white pom-poms, one yellow pom-pom, two different types of yarn, and some glue dots. The glue dots will help us put our ornaments together. The next thing I'm pulling out is a small lidded cup. It has one cork, some googly eyes, and a pom-pom. I have some glue a foam brush, a pair of scissors, two different wreath shapes. One is made out of styrofoam and one is made out of twigs. I have two different clear hollow ornaments. One is shaped like a light bulb and the other one is a round sort of disc shape. I have one pine cone and then two bundles of yarn. One bundle is just a bundle of green yarn and the other one is green yarn, some green and red yarn, two jingle bells and a pipe clean, or not a pipe cleaner, but a twist tie. We'll actually use the twist tie too. It will help us get our yarn onto our jingle bells. So that's everything that you should have in your kit. You can also use the bag of your kit if you cut it open to work on and make it so you have a nice clean surface to work on as you're making your holiday ornaments. So remember, if you have any questions or you're missing anything, you can either email me or post in our classroom and Miss Carrie and I will respond. Also, if your adult says it's okay and there's any of the ornaments that you're really excited about, you can post a picture in our classroom to show everyone. Miss Carrie and I would love to see your creations. Well, I'll see you in the first video and I hope you have a lot of fun making all of your holiday ornaments and getting to use them to decorate your house. 
Bye.